yo, yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy AKG and bringing to you guys today is Weekend League Games number 11 through 15, man. And I just want to say, sit back, take out your popcorn or whatever the hell it is you're eating and just enjoy this video because this is, I promise you, one of the best videos I've ever put out. So don't skip anything, promise you, just keep watching and enjoy this video, man. Again, I hope you guys are having a good week, a great week, matter of fact, man. And um, shout out to all you boys that, you know, rock out with me, subscribe to me, like my videos and all that, man. And yo, the comment section has been popping. Like, I've actually, you know, been reading comments and responding to y'all. You guys are funny as hell. <laughs> like, super, super funny I'm talking about, dog. Some of the comments be like, honestly making my day. Like, they were funny. Like, I like funny stuff, you know what I'm saying? So, I love reading them. Keep that positivity going. And um, again, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and smack a like on these video. Go ahead and subscribe, I mean, to the channel. Turn your, turn your notifications on so you get notified every time I upload a video, man. Again, thank you guys for the 10,000 case, you know, 10,000 subscribers. And um, I should have a, you know, a, a big news coming soon. So, hopefully you guys will like it. I don't know how some of you guys will take it and, the, you know, and whatnot. But, yeah, let's get into Madden now, man. Oh, another thing in the comment section I have to uh, address the kicker i see a lot of you guys asking about why is my kicker meter so slow it's because um like how do i put it oh the chemistry the chemistry or the ability like my kicker has that chemistry to where um it slows down the meter a little bit and like my kicker is like it's worth two million coins and whatnot so yeah he better be doing that out there for me <laughs> you know what i'm saying but yeah back here to madden as you see todd Gurley is just doing todd Gurley things man this dude is a beast and we're playing as this dude named Maldreas Daddy. He's a Cowboys fan, I guess. And that is one funny gamer tag. And right there, he throws it right at Talvin Smith. Man, I need to I need to put Talvin Smith in one of my thumbnail front. Like the top three, I need I have to put him out there, man. Talvin Smith honestly be balling out for me, man. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. Out here, dumping the ball to Vernon Davis. About to take this to the crib and go up 14-0, man. Early on, first quarter, three minutes remaining. Only a minute into the game, man. I'm out here flooding already. Currently. 10 and 0 and this just made it 11 and 0 i guess because the you know connection to your peer is about to be lost this guy probably threw his xbox out the window who knows but yeah just waiting for it to set connection to your peer has me lost and there it is 11 and 0 boys trying to keep this streak rolling get into game number 12 man again if you're new to this channel boys got to keep reminding y'all man subscribe to the channel you do not want to miss out share this video with your friends boys put them onto my channel Man, let's get it. So coming out, we're playing as OG Dig Jags, Dig Gags, whatever you want to pronounce it. 25. He's a Bears fan, I guess. He's in Bears uniform. And he's out here rolling with Jordan Howard. And number eight in the backfield, I believe that's Steve Young at quarterback. And Jordan Howard just juke. Oh, man. One, oh, man. Please tackle him. Thank you, though. <laughs> Yo. Oof. When running backs are in the open field, man, I don't know. I just get scared. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. Coming out here, my opponent went, drove down the field, and uh, he settled for three. I ended up holding for three points. And right here, my running back off to the flat rod, but it is not open. Oh, my God. Steven won the read from me. <laughs> Greg Olsen off to the races. He is super slow. I'm surprised he outran Chantel and all of them for a touchdown. Man, let's go. We go up seven to three. Four-point lead real quick on third and inches. My guy tosses the ball. Jordan Howard, and I guess it's Jordan Howard turn, y'all. Like, never mind. Ronnie Locke catches him from the behind. Let's go. Seven rushes so far already. Second quarter, 83 rushing yards for Jordan Howard. Another halfback handoff. Oh, I forgot to let you guys know. This guy was an inside zone specialist. Like, he ran inside zone a lot. What I mean by a lot? Like, a lot, a lot. You know what I'm saying? So, coming out here again, he settled for another three. So, now we're only up one point. My dude Mike Vick dropping back in the pocket. Steve Smith just literally wide open down the field. So I'm going to just chuck it, lob it to him, and Steve Smith with his first touchdown of the game. Man, let's get it. Dive into the end zone and celebrating. Going up 14-6. to six. Let's get it. Second quarter, a minute, you know, remaining. A little less than two minutes right here. Just bait him into throwing the vertical drop, which he doesn't. And guess who, boys? J.J. Watt. Let's go, man. Dude, I just... <laughs> J.J. is the best defensive end in the game, period. Like, just literally go get yourself a JJ. And if you want the best receiver, you guys already know T.Y. Hill. And, and as you can see right there, Chan Bailey came through free on that sack. And um, we forced him to punt the rock to us, man. On 4th and 21, he punts it. T.Y. Hilton trying to return it. T.Y. just does everything for you. He is out there route running people, you know, just routing corners out there, catching crazy catches and 
and you know just returning punts and everything but right there my opponent came through on that sack Aaron Donald coming through in the middle and he sacked me so I lost 10 yards off of that T.Y. Hilton over the top post route is not there this dude baited me into throwing the other post route to Steve Smith and he picks the ball off with his is that Sean Taylor Patrick Peterson like who who uses a <laughs> oh my god <laughs> who uses a corner in my oh man dude ultimate team is just hilarious but anyways right there he literally threw right at my user and that should have been a pick and you know we ended up getting the fumble so basically i got my turnover back Jalen ramsey off to the races i'm spamming right trigger like one of you guys recommend in the comment section let's go man shout out to you guys for helping me out in the comment section and actually giving me tips you know what i'm saying that's hell so on first and 10 right here under 10 seconds remaining this guy Kept his eye down the field and he died at me. So he's about to get three before halftime and make it nine instead of six. So, oh my God. Oh my God. Never mind. <laughs> I end up blocking that kick right there. And I actually want you guys to remember that kick because, not to spoil this video, but, oh man, just, <laughs> just remember that kick block because I'm about to get super lucky later on in the game. Just keep watching this video, man. I'm telling you guys, this is about to be one of the funniest and best videos I've ever uploaded on YouTube, period. Right there, hand off the tie, girl. He's spinning outside, one man to beat. Oh my God, I should have juked that guy, but I did not. So I end up going, driving down the field inside the 20 yard line man on the 16 to be exact second and five right here my tight end on the corner route just routing people out there greg olsen that is a dot let's go greg olsen out there balling for me man that playmaker chemistry on him playmaker ability or whatever you want to call it and he's just he's just out there balling him and ty hilton are like my top two best receivers um receiving you know um options i should say so toe chip Whatever his gamer tag is, this is the game right here, boys. This is the game where Randy Moss got wild, boys. Just keep watching, you know what I'm saying? Again, this video is finna be lit, I promise you, boys. Right here, this guy's in tight flex, dumping the ball off to number 11, who's Julio Jones, of course. I'm guessing this guy's a Falcons fan. He has Steve Young back there, you know, slinging that rock. But he drove down the field. I ended up holding him to three points. And he, of course, was smart and he took his three. So it looks like he's in dollar, if I'm not mistaken. And right here, running that PA shot post play, of course, you guys already know that post right over the top is not there. He's linebacker. Ruben Foster comes through free and sacks me. So on fourth and 13, I'm looking for a first down. Literally need 13 yards to pick this first down up. Post right over the top. Possession catches C. Smith. Let's go, man. And he hangs on to it. Boys, I'm going to miss Steve Smith, man. Sorry for, again. I'm going to have to get rid of him. We all know who just came out. And y'all already, if you guys been watching me since Madden 18, y'all know Tyree Hill just have to be on the squad, dog. And Tyree Hill team of the week just came out. So I have to pick him up. And I will be getting rid of, um, what's his name? Steve Smith Sr. for real soon. But I'm down to the end zone on first and 10 right here. Just chilling in the pocket with my man Mike Vick. Dumping the ball to Todd Gurley. And my man hangs on to that. Picks up about 12 yards on that play. But here it is, y'all. Randy Moss, y'all. <laughs> y'all know what time it is, man. Oh, my God. Slow motion. My man went up with one hand. Literally about five defenders in the area. And he hanged. Dude, Randy Moss is crazy, dog. He really just went up with one hand. With the other hand, literally right next to his. I'm not even going to say it, but y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know how Marshawn Lynch, Marshawn Lynch would dive into the end zone. Yep. That's exactly literally what Randy Moses did, teabagging people out there. And he hang, you know, he hangs on to that for the touchdown. But right here on third and six, man, second quarter still under two minutes remaining. This guy, I don't know what the hell he's doing, but he just dropped by like 20 yards, dog. Right here, chilling with Steve Smith. And I mean uh, Steve Young, and he just throws it right at Sherman Dern. My man Sherman picks the ball up, trying to return it, but Sherman is just super tired because that play just took like 20 seconds just to develop. But coming out here. With a minute remaining before halftime, Todd Gurley on that angle around my playmaker right back inside, and that is a dot. Cutting back inside, spinning back outside, and he picks up about 15 yards on that play. So on second and 17, another angle route, but it's not there. So I'm gonna take up with Mike Vick. I get hit stick, and my man recovers it. Man, come on, AKG, just slide. Jeez, dude, I'd be so stubborn. So I'm like, I don't know. I guess I just wanna have fun. But 
right here he thought he had us beat no 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 not today baby my man Jalen Ramsey that recovery speed he's just out there man I click on and I just pick that off let's go and right here I'm looking for a one play touchdown going back to the Madden 18 cover three beater it is just not there and again like I said earlier man the playmaker on my tight end just coming through clutch and I ended up taking my three right before halftime just being smart going up 10 to 3 a seven point lead and coming out of halftime i get ball coming out of halftime too so i'm gonna put on that two clock and start toting man but boys just watch this right here dog ty Gurley, off to the races man dun dun run run girly run girly run we out of here ah oh, let's go man first play coming out of the halftime i'm in ty Gurley, off to the races and he scores so we go up 14 points my opponent needs a whole two touchdowns just even think about tying this game right here playmakers receiver back inside that is randy moss and he hangs on to that picks up the first down but here on third and eight vertical route over the top he tries to throw it that would have been 100 percent interception because there was one route that was open and i was using that so fourth and 16 sending heat at him nobody's open the in route is covered I don't know where he's throwing, but I know he's throwing right at my user. Deion Jones picks that off, trying to return it, but Julio comes up with the tackle from behind. So up 14 points, about to run this drive post play, but I'm going to fade Randy Moss because I just feel like he's about to beat my opponent. Never mind. Tiger is coming off the backfield because he sent everybody. I had to get him, you know, make a quick read, and Tiger hangs on to that. So I'm actually having a really good passing game with uh, Mike Vick, man. Eight for nine. You know, passing really well. And right there, in route to Randy Moss, one man to beat. Skirt! Bring them ankles here, boy. Where is you going, though? Let's go. Off to the races. 15 to 10 to 5. Look, Randy Moss, dog. Out there, balling his second touchdown of the game. And my opponent's had enough. He's about to pause the game and quit out, man. GG's to him. The game ended up being 23 to 3. Currently 13 and 0, oh, y'all. I got to keep this streak alive. Let's go. Two more games remaining for this video right here, and I just got to make the best out of them, though. I'm just trying to bring you guys the best gameplay, man. If you guys are enjoying this video, go ahead and smack a like on it if you're new to the channel. Subscribe. Turn notifications on. Join the notification gang, man. Let's get it. Right here, we're playing against John Weasel. You guys seen his stop three, right? It doesn't matter. This guy came out here dotting me. Like, when I say dotting, bro, sometimes it's scheme over team. Because this dude's scheme was actually tough, and I liked it until table turn. But, hey, doesn't matter. Right here, post route over the top. He playmakers receiver back inside, and that is a dot. So, two for four, 20 yards passing with Baker Mayfield. But hey, he's still dotting. Y'all just keep watching. On fourth and one right here, I am in four, six defense. His tight end is taking forever to get down the field, man. Jimmy Graham. And I like this D. I actually have to do a breakdown this four, six defense for you boys. I kind of like it, and I feel like I should help you guys with it. Let me know in the comment section if you guys would like this defense and, you know, like to win some games. Like I said, this guy came out dotting. And right there, corner out to the left side, picks up the first down, fourth and one. And right here, another post route over the top, hangs onto it. That's a good play, actually, man. Although it wasn't traffic, he hung onto it. And right here on second and goal, high ball, and, and what the... All right, that might have not been a dot. I don't know what that was, but Randy Moss hung, you know, just doing more stuff. I can't even get mad because Randy does the same exact thing for me. Post route over the top to see Smith. That is a dot, man. Across midfield already on his 46 yard line. Picking up 31 yards on that play. Mike Vick back there. Just do it. Imagine Mike Vick. Imagine if he had conductor and gunslinger, man. Oh, my God. Yo, JJ, just leave me alone for once. Like, dog, I cannot go a game without getting sacked by JJ. This is annoying. <laughs> like, damn, bro. Can he? Can you just sack people for me and not sack me instead? T.Y. Hilton down the field, man. Getting his first reception of the game. That is a dot. 65 yards passing so far two for two with mike vick in the second quarter and i'm gonna just go in and sell for my three because this guy played good defense down there man so he's up instead of me being up early and he takes over again man on third and six right here i'm just rushing four people right here with a spy on the field and hard flats i should have went um cloud flats but i went hard and this guy just dotted me although he is seven for 11 although he has missed four you know passes He's still moving the rock, you know, efficiently, and um, he's being consistent with it. So, as I say that, <laughs> he finds another guy open who's Saquon Barkley off to the flat routes. Now he's 9 for 13. So, on third, third and 9 right here, 
this is where it blew my mind he ran the rock on third and nine when he's been passing throughout the entire game but it was a really he's a really smart play it was a good play call there was no time left on the clock and he obviously needed a burnt clock to bring it to halftime and you know just take his three so definitely a smart play by him and he goes up seven points coming out of half hopefully i get ball because all right never mind yes i do so first and ten coming out of halftime right here Mike Vick in the backfield, chilling. My tight end, I'm going to just play making him up the field. That is a dot, man. Rat catching with Greg Olson and across midfield already. I'm having a perfect game with Vick, matter of fact, y'all. Four for four, 110 yards passing. My tight end should have been on the streak right there, but I don't know who told him to get on the whip route. It doesn't matter. Playmaking, Randy Moss up the field. My man, Randy Moss, really out there juking the air. Like, <laughs> what are you doing, though? On second and eight, though, inside the 20-yard line, man. Three man, regular three man rush. I'm gonna just high ball to my tight end, Greg Olsen. Go in and do the team celebration for me one time. Coach Madden is hyped. The entire team is hyped, and I'm hyped myself. We have the game all tied up. All right. I think this guy's been dotting me enough, and I actually think it's time to box him up. So, Tim Bailey got the plans. Come through free, sacks him, man. Let's go. Bacon Mayfield back there just trying to, you know, give his team some points. Tim Bailey got other plans, boys. I'm telling you, boys. Tim Bailey came out to ball today, and, um, we end up, you know, holding him to a consist, just recycling like three plays in a row. And he ended up punting the ball to us on fourth and like 28 and whatnot. So this drive post play right here in this single back. I mean, Guns Ace Twins. Again, another high back angle to Ty Gurley. Spinning back outside, one man to beat, but we get stopped. Perfect game again, man. Eight for eight with Mike Vick. This guy is out there just throwing dots. Mike Vick is just dotting. Corner out, another dot, 9 for 10. I did miss an incomplete high ball to my tight end, which messed up the perfect game by Mike Vick. But Ty Gurley punches it in, and we finally take the lead in this fourth quarter, boys. And this guy is already on the fourth and 10. I need this stop right here to end this game. So I'm sending the dogs at him. Champ Bailey off that left side. Champ, I need you to come through one more time again for me. One time for the one time, man. Cross manning both of the receivers. This is actually literally a bad play because like i mean bad defense because literally what he just ran was the perfect play call for the defensive adjustments i made he had a corner out route with the slot guy and i had manned up the inside receiver i mean the outside receiver with my outside corner so y'all seen the play but my um i ended up getting lucky my outside quarter obviously batted the ball down they added into the game this year with the you know awareness to the corners another high ball to my tight end that time we going up 24 to 10 and this game is pretty much over man the time is against my opponent as you can tell the game is over because he just came out running the ball and um he just i guess he's trying to chew clock on fourth and two though he no huddles i have hard flats everywhere man up the outside receiver on the left side who's randy moss he runs play action play regular three-man rush pulls right over the top he gets hit stick by my man ronnie lot and he drops it uh so that's pretty much how this game is going to end unless he starts calling timeouts and whatnot which is actually like kind of funny because he actually does like if you're trying to save time so you can come back into the game why are you calling timeouts i mean while he was actually you know out there running the ball early i don't i just don't get some people but anyway game is over gg swim again if y'all liking this video smack a like on it Keep them subscriptions coming, man. Let's grow together. Let's get it. 14 and 0, last and final game of this video right here. And boy, this is where it gets crazy. Let me know in the comment section if I'm lying, y'all. Please, just let me know if I'm lying. Tell me not. Every game 15 of Weekend League, it literally just says, yo, we're not going to let you win this game. We just want your opponent to win. And this is what happens in this game. If you keep watching, you're going to see. Greg, as Greg Olsen breaks the tackle, you know, that went my way, obviously. But keep watching. Two for two so far, 56 yards passing. So I get down the field with Mike Vick right here, y'all. Regular four-man rush. Nobody's open, so I'm going to just take off, run it with Mike Vick. Shoestring tackle. Yeah, just go on YouTube and type in Mike Vick highlights. And please, show me a video of Mike Vick getting shoelace tackle or getting touched by hands and he fumbles up. That's just like my pet peeve, number one in Madden. Like right, right now, just take that out of the game. Like, please, bro, just remove that completely. That is, it's not realistic whatsoever at all. It's not just Vic. It's just every quarterback too. It's so annoying. But my opponent has Ricky Williams and Ryan Shazier. He is a mutt master, I guess, and whatnot. So, um, this guy's in Raiders uniform, USC Trojan. Me and this guy actually have history. Like, I just. 
I just dislike him as a Madden player. I don't know. And he talks to, like, a bunch of trash in the uh, Twitch chat, too. So, we got bad blood. You can see it pretty much. Right there, corner out to Steve Smith. That is a dot. Three for four right now. 69 yards passing. This guy runs a lot of man coverage, and he uses his free safety, which kind of throws, you know, was throwing me off throughout the game. But I have main beaters out there. It doesn't really matter. Greg Olsen, he's eating so far. I mean, my tight end is actually eating right now. And um, right there, playmaker to Randy Moss. It's not there. I'm going to just take over Mike Vick. At, at that point, like, after the first tackle was broken, I thought I got sacked. So I kind of looked away. And as soon as I looked back up to my TV, I was like, oh, shoot. He's still on his feet. I tried to take off. That definitely was on me. And that first fumble definitely was not. But the second fumble was on me 100%. So my opponent is up three points. And he's the type that runs the ball, like, a lot. A lot, a lot. He runs the ball a lot. So... On 36 right there, you see, and I click on to Xavier Rose, and he strips Antonio Brown, and he ended up getting no points on that drive, man. So second half already, y'all. He has Rob Wilson back there returning. We come out laying the lumber. Let's go, man. Rob Wilson coughed the ball off, and now we take over. Thank God EA gave me back my fumble for the one, you know, that should have never been fumbled. And right there, as you can see, Mike, Ville, Mike Vick just sailing the throw. And I showed that clip. I literally never showed any completions, but I showed that clip because you got to keep just keep in mind what happened all right so he overthrew that right there in the third quarter fine whatever i ended up getting three just keep in mind mike vick overthrew my pass and i'm gonna bring that up later just remember that and right here in route he is in saints playbook a thousand percent guarantee he came out in bunch tight end um he came out in i mean pistol bunch tight end he's came out in five wide out he's been in single back all that extra stuff so he's definitely in saints as I talk about five wide, he is in five wide, you know, right, right now. And he dumps the ball off to number 12, but it gets stripped again by Xavier Rose. Xavier Rose is having himself a game right now, boys. Let's go, man. He's balling. So, it's all tied up, fourth and nine. Fourth and nine, y'all. T.Y. Hilton, that is a dot. Let's go, man. Off to the races inside the 15-yard line. And I'm going to end up taking my three. Be smart. There's, like... This guy was playing good defense. I'm not going to lie to you, boys. He was playing good defense. But that fumble changes the game. Like, one fumble changed the entire football game. It does not matter. Like, at all. Even if it's in the first quarter and you still got three more quarters to play, it doesn't matter. That one fumble changes everything. Right there, like Ricky Williams spinning inside. And he finally gets tackled by, again, Xavier Rhodes, man. And right here on 4th and 11. Oh, my goodness. We get the kick block. No, come on, dog. I missed it. Oh, my dog. Oh, my God, dude. That's going to hunt me. But it doesn't matter. Remember that play and remember that same animation. Just keep watching. Again, the same overthrow I told you guys. Remember in the third quarter? Look, Mike Vick, man. Mike Vick, literally, if T if Mike Vick doesn't overthrow that, the game's over already. Like, the game is over. T.Y. was by himself. There was no safety help over the top. The corner was in a hard flat. Like, oh, my God, though. You're kidding me. There's no way the streak ends like this, right? Yup, it does. Oh, my God, though. He hangs on to that. My dude is in field goal range, y'all. Oh, my God. I call the timeout to ice him. Hopefully, I get lucky right here. Hopefully, I get lucky right here. And oh, my God. No way. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Let's go. We end up blocking the kick and we take over, dog. Overtime. Dog, there's no way that just happened. Like, I can't believe that. <laughs> there's just no way. It's overtime, y'all. And right here, he throws right at my user. My boy, Telvin Smith. Oh, my goodness, bro. What is going on right now, dog? The way this game just went, like, the momentum changed. That's pretty much it for this video, though, man. I go ahead and kick my field goal. GG's in the chat for USC Trojans, man. I love you guys. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Drop a like on this video. I know you boys enjoyed it. I'll catch y'all later, man. See y'all in the comment section. Peace out.